Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna show you how I conceal this tattoo and go from this to this. Really easy and really simple in just a matter of minutes. Alright, so jumping straight into this tutorial, the first thing that I'm going to do is that I'm taking some rubbing alcohol and I'm cleaning the area to make sure that it is oil free. Next, I'm taking some tissue just to protect my clothing because I don't want the makeup to transfer while I'm doing it. Next, I'm going with the start of the show. This is Derma Blend Leg and Body Cover. Now, this makeup is long wear and it's high coverage and it's specifically marketed to cover leg and body imperfections. So, anything like tattoos, stretch marks, varicose veins, scars, you know, the list goes on. And it comes in a variety of different shades and the shades that I am using is called Dark. Next, I am using my finger and then I'm gonna go in with a flat makeup brush and I'm just gonna go working in small sections first and I'm gonna apply thin layers and I'm just gonna use the brush and smooth it all over the area or the tattoo, well my tattoo but the area that you want to cover. And y'all I'm doing this in slow time, trying to edit as little as possible so that you can see, you know, no magic or anything involved. The product is just that good. I know this is not sponsored but I swear by this product. And you can see me here, I'm just shifting to make sure if the light is good and then I abandon the brush and I'm going exclusively with my fingers and I do this specifically for the edges because I want to make sure that they're a little feathered and that they blend in more with my skin. All right, and here we're going in for the second layer of makeup. And I'm just speeding this up because it's the same thing that I did before. And next I'm going in with Derma Blend Loose Setting Powder and I am using this in the shade Warm Saffron. This is just going to set the makeup and make sure that it doesn't transfer or fade and is waterproof. So I'm taking a makeup sponge and I'm just going to apply a thin even layer all to the makeup, all to the Derma Blend that I would have applied previously. Once that's done, I am going to use a loose or a makeup brush and I'm just gonna dust away the excess powder and that is basically it now I could have did a little better on the blending but you get the general idea if you practice and you take your time you can get this down pat as I said I love this product if you have anything you want to cover any skin perfections give this product a try i hope that you enjoyed this the whole tutorial if you have please give this video a massive thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel if you have not as yet so until next time bye bye